Perkins Summer here of the Girls with Glasses show. And we are with Rachel Bagley of Cardigan Empire. That's and, her blog. And she also has her own YouTube channel. Rachel Bagley. That's right. And she's got cute hair. Adorable. Tell us what we're gonna do today. Today we are taking that cozy trend of fall and winter, the sweatshirt, and we are shining it up. We're adding some ice to it. So I love fancy. It. We are making sparkle sweatshirts. Oh, <laughs> cute. Uh, so it's super easy. You can make one of these for all your besties. It's cheap. Yes. You're gonna love it. Comfy and sparkly. Sparkly and cheap. I'm in. And you can make it yourself. It's a craft. I love crafting. Yeah. Step I one. Step one, you need to find your sweatshirts. Now, okay. I found these little numbers at H&M. Always. Ten dollars a piece. And they're great fits. Old Navy, wherever you find it, you can do a... Forever 21, I found some good simple sweatshirts yeah. that have a good Just your basics. Fit. You want to have a good line and you're ready to go. Two. Step two. <laughs> Step two is one of my favorite steps because here is where you get to put all that broken jewelry piece. You know the ones that are sitting in your jewelry cabinet somewhere that your dog tore apart or your child chewed on. Here we go. The one earring you have. You can mix it in. It's it's the other one. It always yeah. kind of breaks my heart, but this is like, this is redemption. When you're picking out your jewelry, you want to look for things that are either flat and strung together because they're, they're going to have holes in them and you can, you know, sew them on. Or you're looking for things that you can, you know, back on some felt and glue on. So if you're okay. going with the strung option, this is where you get to take out the fancy scissors. Snip, snip. Yes. You know, you get to see all those beads fall. Or maybe they're already broken apart. Find something fabulous that's already soldered together and you don't want to snip. You can actually back it yourself. This one we found already with some felt on the back of it. Nice. But just take your necklace, cut yourself a little pattern, fabric glue it on, and you've got that ready to go. So oh. we just, this, this step here we're it just made for this. So. We can use our wire cutters. We can get really fancy cutting yeah, things I like apart. That. Step four. Now, step four is where we're going to start arranging it on the sweatshirt. You're going to take all your materials okay. and you're going to start thinking about how you want to display it on. So this your is where the real creativity. Yeah, style. this is where your design style. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. I know. Now, is you don't want it too close to the edge of the collar mm -hmm. because then we're going to get droopiness again. You can make it as complicated and fancy or, or as simple and modern as you want it, it is really, the world is open to you. That's the beauty of DIY. Yes. Beauty. Step number five. Step number five. This is our careful step because okay. here we're going to attach. And we've only got one shot at this. Yeah, no going back. There's no going back. You glue once in okay. this situation, ladies, because if we put down the glue and we move it, then you got a glue spot. Be able to either glue those on using fabric glue. You can use a hot glue gun, but the thing about hot glue is it can peel off. Yeah, it does happen. Fabric time. glue, a little more tacky, not in a bad way, it's still right. cheap. <laughs> when you're laying these on, especially when you're starting like with a big piece like this, you want to start in the center. Because yeah. if we start over here and we're like, oh, I'm doing so good, and then you realize, oh wait, yeah. it's, it's too Can I point too something out? If yeah. many of these sweatshirts that you find will have that little um, triangle detail, it kind of helps give you a center point to start from, and yeah. it kind of makes it easy. And even yeah. if you're sewing, you got to be careful because if you do too many of those knots, you're going to end up with a hole in the shirt. So we want to be careful about this. Uh, Go ahead, secure it all. Turn way. on an excellent episode of you know natural. Yeah, yeah. Except, oh my goodness, it's getting very intense. I feel like I can't. I don't know if I can sew anymore. Yeah, that. I know but you might get too distracted. You oh, know, yeah. Downton Abbey would be a great. Downton Abbey. You could feel. You could feel. You feel get very your like. Out. Yeah. Like Yes. You need a thimble with down to Abby. So, yeah. and you can sew, put on some little glasses. Yes. Little tiny readers. Okay, there you go. That is <laughs> this is, this, it's already ready That's for you nice. guys. We have yeah. basically prepped every part of this process for you. Well, you might watch. But you know, you need a thimble. You, and you need thimble. some cookies, like little tiny yeah. cookies. Oh, yes. Tea cookies. Tea cookies. Yes, they have those at Trader Joe's. Rachel, thank you so much. I You're am welcome. never taking it off. Well, good. Ever. We are blinged out and ready yes. for any occasion, any party. We're there. Or just sitting on the couch. Yeah, we're <laughs> fancy. We're comfortable. It all goes months. with glitter. It goes with jeans. It goes with whatever you yes. want to pair with it. And, I, and I'm warm and cozy. Mm -hmm. I just and you look fancy out there. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Rachel Bagley. Yes. Check out her YouTube channel and Cardigan Empire. Check it. Fashion blog. Her. So. I love DIY history. <laughs> it's a real word, everybody. We we coined that. Webster will be calling later. Yes.